Hey folks, welcome back to Junior Dev. I have something very exciting to share. That's my recent dive into, yes, the Zellig Multiplexer. Now, I kind of stumbled upon this quite by accident and in just three days, it has reshaped the way I use the terminal. Now, I'm a little late to the Zellig game. I already see its potential to be a total game changer for my workflow. So let's kick things off by getting to know Zellig. What is it? Well, if you're not a geek like me, you probably think that it's a planet in like some far, far away galaxy or something, right? Well, no, it's a terminal multiplexer. And it's designed for geeks just like us. People who use NeoVim and tmux the only thing is as zelich steps in to refine the user experience for those of us accustomed to the challenges of tmux and neovim zelich is presenting a potential solution now let's get down to what really stands out in zelich it's key bindings unlike tmux where finger gymnastics were part of the routine Zellige's key bindings are refreshingly intuitive. Navigating through panes and windows feels very straightforward. Speaking of simplicity, Zellige's approach to pain management is a real gem. Its logical in managing pains has become a task I no longer dread. The process of splitting, resizing, it's the kind of simplicity that makes you question why you ever endured the TMUX complexity before. For the NeoVim enthusiasts, Zellige integrates seamlessly with a touch of elegance. It respects NeoVim's nuances while adding its own layer of grace. It's like finding a dance partner who knows all the right moves. And if you're like me, I can't dance, so I need someone who who knows all the right dance moves, right? And this enables me to transition between tasks. And this becomes a smooth choreographed routine. So let's talk about customization. A real revelation with Zellige. Tailoring it to fit my preferences felt like discovering a hidden superpower. Suddenly, my terminal setup felt uniquely mine bringing it a level of personalization that this old codger couldn't be happier about. And then there's the Z alias, a touch of convenience that adds simplicity. Setting it up in my Bash RC isn't exactly groundbreaking, I know, but it is rather convenient, not to mention the fact that I wasn't sure I would remember how to spell Zellich. Now, before I conclude, I just briefly want to talk about my history with Tmux. I've known about the benefits of Tmux for years, but it never quite clicked for me. NeoVim's development in Lua brought some really interesting features, but its terminal behavior didn't align with my preferences. This is where Zellige steps in, not just replacing Tmux, but potentially prompting me to uninstall a few more NeoVim packages very soon. My journey with Zellige was a little unexpected, as you can see. And as someone who's set in their ways, I'm kind of embracing this. So if you're in the same situation where you need a change, you might just make the jump. You might find it's not too late to learn new tricks. Don't forget to share your thoughts and comments in the section below. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and to ring that notification bell. Also, I do live coding, live music, and a lot of live banter on Twitch every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday. Join me. It's just a lot of fun. And last but not least, happy coding, fellow devs. May your terminal experiences evolve in unexpected ways.